Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here and today we are back with another video now as you guys can see right now We are currently in a room six out of six now This is actually our queso cup match We are going to be facing Vatra who I think currently is in a playoff spot now We are 5-0 and as you guys saw from the last video We are undefeated tied with tribe gaming and this is our second last match of the season We're gonna go on and face Vatra right now and then tribe next match so what we're gonna do and i don't think we've ever done this before and i haven't seen this too much is we're actually going to record our competitive games live now there's not going to be any voice comms with the team i think we're going to maybe do that next video for tribe but i want to try a live competitive game video i don't know how it's going to go i'm really scared because we usually vc and which is voice chat that helps a lot and there's really no communication or anything so it's going to be a little bit more difficult but we're gonna do our very best. So Toonie's basically deciding all the comps since... Oh, oh, I'm on the wrong gadget. I, I mean, star power, that's already a rough start, but... Let's see how it goes. Now, I forgot to say the bands. I'll put the bands in a sec. So you usually start at, shoot at the start to see what server you're playing on. It looks like we're playing on Iowa or something like that. Um, so I'm gonna go forward and just try and get some shots hit over here. These guys are very good at gem grab. I think it's their best mode. Lost our Leon turret over there. We're gonna try and help Zar out. Get the kill. Bobby's teammate, by the way, is Toonie. He changed his name. I think he lost a bet or something. I'm not too sure. But they have really good pressure on us right now. The Sandy's probably sneaking on us. Yeah. We're able to get the kill over there. We have no clue where the Sandy is. Oh, there it is. Oh, that's not very good. We're going to go down. Toonie's going to get the kill. And now I think it's basically Zar versus the Bell for who can pick up the gems. Um, I think Zar might have a gadget, so he should be able to do so. He's able to pick them up, but he does hit a trap. We are going to be able to pick up the gems, though. We're fine. I don't know where the Rico is. Okay, there it is. I don't think it's smart for me to pick up the final gem, so I'm hoping that maybe Toonie can come back and do so. He's going to go down... Zara is also going to go down, so I'm just going to go forward and pick this up. Put some traps everywhere. But this is kind of looking like a win right now. Going to try and get that kill. Toonie's going to be able to get it, and I'm just going to stand right over here. And that is going to be game number one. So a little bit of a sketchy start. Wrong star power, you know, losing at the start. But it did turn around, and we were able to take the W. So we're going to take the set lead 1-0. So I forgot to say the bands. Vatra band, Buzz, and Gene. Um, pretty good bands for them. A little bit of a target ban on the Gene, maybe. Or maybe they don't like playing it. And I think we ban... Let me check. We ban Sprout and Ash. We don't like Ash. And Sprout is just kind of... You know, you guys know the story with Sprout. I don't have to say it. So we got to win one more game in order to take this set. And be up 1-0 in sets. So we're going to discuss comps. And we'll be back in just a second. Okay, so we're going to stick with the same comp for game two. Now, the reason we stick with this is it's just a really good comp. Juan Carlos is a really good Sandy, so they're not going to Leon. Instead, they're going to Sandy. But I like our comp, and it's pretty safe, pretty good into everything. Um, so we basically just got to try and do what we did in the mid last game. I think we did a pretty good job. Going to get an early trap to start things off. Juan Carlos is just going to run in a straight line into our spawn. We're going to try and help Toonie. We're going to be able to win that lane. So this is a pretty good start. Don't know if Zar got a kill. I think he did. Yeah, he did. A good start for us so far here. They have good position, like, not in their spawn, but pretty deep into their territory. Oops, did not mean to click that button. We're going to put traps down. And, I mean, this game is just going really well for us so far. We have really good position. Now, hopefully we don't overextend. I think Toonie went a little bit too high up there. But it's okay, because he probably is going to get a super from that. I was thinking about getting that gem, but I didn't want to get stunned by the Sandy. Being up 6-0, there's really no point of taking unnecessary risks. Especially when we have three tra uh, tra bleh, three traps just laid out in the middle. We're going to be able to get a kill over there. Juan Carlos almost kills us. He's not going to be able to, though, and we should be able to pick up that kill. We are. Again, I'm going to move up a little bit slowly here because I don't have full HP. Not going to go grab that last gem. Instead, I'm going to wait for the next one. Going to pick it up. Super the mid. There's probably going to be a bell there. I don't know if I hit the bell or not. Maybe I did. But that's going to be game two. I mean, that one was pretty simple, pretty straightforward. I think we did a really good job there. Pinching the Sandy at the start was definitely a good strategy to win this game because the Sandy was pretty annoying last game. But last game, I think we got it out pretty... Or this game, sorry. I think we got it out pretty fast. And again, this is really hard to do, by the way. It is really hard to play like the high, highest level of comp and like try and record and 
cast or explain everything at the same time. So if I mess up my words or if I call someone something not toxic, like if I call Sandy a Leon or something, you know, it's just, it's just really hard to multitask and do this. Uh, but so far, so good. We're going to take the first set and next is going to be Sneaky Field. So I don't really know what the comp's going to be here. Toonie is in charge of comps today, so... I want to read the group chat, I want to see what he says, and we will be back for game one. Okay, so for this game, it is going to be Sneaky Fields. We're going to go Max, Sandy, Rosa. Toonie's known for his Rosa, and Zara's been playing a lot of Max, so... That's basically the reasoning for this comp. I guess I'm going to have to lane a spike, which is going to kind of suck, but... Oh, never mind. Let's just slow this guy down right here. We do not want a Rosa running at us. Pretty good start for us. I think we're able to pick up two kills. Unfortunately, I wasn't part of that speed over there. But we're able to get a quick first goal. Tuni, give me the ball. Give me the ball, Tuni. Tuni, give me the ball. Give me the ball, Tuni. All right, never mind. Tuni does not want to give me the ball. Um, but either way, I think we're going to be ending up with a goal right here. Tuni did just get hit for like 3k, so maybe not. Unless Zar can put it in. Uh, Zar does not put it in. So no goal for us. We definitely could have scored over there. That's kind of lack of VC. If we had VC right there, it would have been a goal. But that kind of just shows how important VC is. Good kill over there by Toonie. Definitely just bailed me out and kept me alive. He's gonna be able to get one over there. He gets a second. Thank you, Toot. Okay, I thought I messed that up. I really thought I messed that up. But we're gonna be able to get the goal. And it is now one to nothing for us. Oh, I tried to dodge that slow, but I wasn't able to. Toonie's just gonna walk forward here. I'm one shot to super. I'm gonna use my super. Oh, I don't really want this. Just corner the ball over there. I'm gonna go down, but the rose is one shot. The spike's pretty low. I have no stuns left, which kind of sucks, but we're in a pretty good spot right here. We have a really good comp. We just gotta stay alive. Rose is gonna go forward. Gotta try and get it low. There we go. Gonna try and sneak out the other side over here. We're gonna be able to get two kills. Just gonna hide. Toonie's going to keep the ball in the corner, and I guess we're just going to spawn trap them. He's going to be able to pick up that kill. I don't know if Zara... Yeah, Zara's not a fan of spawn trap. I guess he's just going to go and get the ball. Never mind. Besides, no ball. We're going to heal up over here. I guess not. We're going to be hit by the Rosa gadget. Zara's going to be able to pick up that kill, though. We're kind of just controlling the mid at the moment. We're going to be able to pick up that kill, and we're kind of just on the spawn trap wave right now. We're going to throw this down and be sneaky. It's just really hard for them to get out of spawn. There's really nothing that they could do. They're just perma spawn trapped for the rest of the game. And that is going to be it, because I really don't think they're gonna walk up the map with 10 seconds left and score, but that is going to be game number one. Now this map is really weird. There's different comps that you can run. There's different comps that are good and there's different comps that are bad. Um, but I think we had the strongest comp. I think their comp is decent, but they might run our comp now. So we're going to talk about potentially trying to counter it. I don't know how to counter this, but we're going to try our best. So let's hop into the next game. We're going to discuss as a team and let's see what we decide. Okay, so for this game, we're going to decide on going Bell, Rico, and Spike. Now, reason for this is basically we want to counter Sandy and Rosa. Now, as the game goes on, it's basically impossible to counter the Sandy, but we're going to try our best either way and this is kind of like a practice match and even though it is very serious and it is queso at the same time you know brawl championship is what matters or really big money tournaments and this is kind of just like a league we know we're going to make the playoffs so we're kind of experimenting with some comps they're going to go nita interesting nita b and spike interesting comp here i think they try to counter the sandy as well Really good comp, actually, by them. I like the Nita. The Nita's a really good pick. Something I really didn't think of. So we just gotta not go down over here. Oh, Toonie's gonna be hit by the 3k. Oh, this guy's tapping, whoever it is. I think we hit him twice. Gonna try and move forward over here. Couple whiffs. Zara's gonna be able to win his lane. Toonie's doing a really good job as well. Zara almost picks up a kill on the B. We're going to be able to do so. And this is where we try and just get some positioning. We don't want to overextend or anything. We just want to hold our positioning. Juan Carlos is one shot. Oh, we're not going to be able to take him out. We get him there. Never mind. Going to try and hit Juan Carlos. We're going to be able to do so. Going for the snipe. I'm going to miss it. I don't want to overextend and lose our positioning. So I'm just going to wait for Tuni to get a super... 
Zara to get a super or something along those lines. Gonna be able to take out the B though. Again, we're just holding position really well here. Gonna pass the ball to Zara. I think he can maybe score. He's gonna go for the trick shot. Oh! And Zara is going to get it. Damn. I'll do a little bit of a spin, obviously, after that one. But we're just gonna try and hold the mid again here. Don't wanna fold it. Soon he's gonna get a really quick lane win, which is really good. Gonna get Juan Carlos to one shot, or not Juan Carlos, whoever their B is. Gonna pass the ball over to Tooney. Trying to get Juan Carlos, not able to do so. He played those angles pretty well. So we're just gonna try and regen again. We're gonna put these traps out. But again, we just kinda have them spawn trapped right now, and there's not too much that they could do. Gonna be able to take out Juan Carlos. They're pretty low right now, so we're gonna try and make a play. Zara's gonna pick up that kill. I'm gonna put it in the net. It's now going to be 2-0 in Brawl Ball, and that is going to be another quick set. So we're up 4-0 in games, but 2-0 in sets. We need one more to take the dub. So again, let's move on to the next set, the next game, and let's see what happens. Okay, so Toonie really wants to Mortis, and zara has been kind of feeling his max as of late. So we're going to do a max tank and Mortis comp. Now, the reason I'm going Daryl is because, as I said earlier, um, Buzz is banned. And what else is banned? I think it's Buzz and an ash so next tank up is going to be daryl gonna go for a spin here just try and get super we're gonna be able to get a really quick kill off the start we are gonna go down but positive elixir trade i guess we are winning so yolo oh this is kind of toxic oh it's poyo hi poyo zatuni is gonna be able oh this looks like a kill for me there we go we're gonna be able to pick that one up gonna hide over here I guess no hiding oh Zara's gonna go down to Poyo Poyo seems to be the best squeak I've ever seen I don't know what Toonie's doing up there but he has extremely low ping so he's probably doing something epic don't want to get killed by oh no this is not good this is very bad let me live please okay there we go we live very cool all right I don't know what this mortis on their team's doing I'm gonna go and get Juan Carlos well, that was kind of toxic of me. That was a really nice kill. I didn't even mean to do that. I was just clicking auto in, but it worked out. We got five stars right now. Kind of high up in position in their spawn. They're trying to hit him with one of the gadget shots. Charges are super very fast, but we weren't able to. Get a roll on Juan Carlos. Oh, no. Oh, I was baited so hard there. They wanted me to do that. I fell for their trap. Three star lead right now for us. Which is a fair amount, but not enough to be comfortable. We're going to roll right onto Poyo. We're going to be able to get that kill. We're going to be able to pick up another kill. We're going to go down. Now we're only up two stars. And they have blue. So it's a pretty interesting game. We can't really die at this point. So we're just going to play really defensive. Toonie's going to go up and get a kill. I guess never mind on playing defensive. I'm just going to try and take up as much of their time as possible. Stay alive, but... We should be fine as long as Toonie lives. I'm just going to spin in their spawn. And that is going to be game one of Bounty. Okay, so for this last game, we might get countered. But we decided we're going to go Mortis, Brock, and Piper. And we did not get countered. Very, very nice. Okay, so it's just going to be a straight snipe off. Now, they do have Leon, which is a little bit toxic. But I think we should be fine into a Leon. It's not going to be the worst thing in the world. Zarge is going to take that out straight away. So good start for us into the Leon. We're going to be able to get a tap on it as well. Um, well that's kind of... Ooh. We're going to get pinched out here. Toxic. All right. Well, they're going to pinch us out. We're actually going to be down 4 nothing, but I still think we're in a fine spot. Going to be able to hit a shot on Pain over there, and Toonie's going to come over and clean it up. Zara's also going to be able to pick up a kill. Just take out this Leon turret over there. Looking for Juan Carlos. Not able to get him. Oh, he's going to sneak on Zara 100%. Oh, he's going to sneak on me too. Oh, my God. That was close. All right. Well, we're kind of backed up into spawn. We still have three curves left. So, that's really good. Zara's going to be able to pick up a kill over there. Juan Carlos has just been in our spawn this entire time. Oh, let's try and help out. We're going to be able to pick up the kill on Poyo. Oh, I was going to curve eye pain, but we weren't able to do so. Just healed up. 
Um, Toonie's a little bit low. If the Byron gets super, it probably can kill him, so... We're in a pretty bad spot, actually, right now. Byron's probably going to get super. Oh, no! We're gonna go down, for sure. Yeah, we're gonna go down, and we're only up two right now. Luckily, we have two curves left, so maybe we can make something work. Gonna go for the kill on one Carlos. We're not gonna be able to get it. Oh, this is bad. This is very bad. Oh, and Toonie is going to go down. Oh, this is bad, bad. This is what I like to call bad, bad. Oh, no! Oh, no! We're gonna lose. See, you bring out the Piper one time, and you just lose. They just, it's hard to run these Piper maps, or these Piper comms, because it's just so toxic. Like, it's it's not just Piper v. Piper anymore. I thought we would be fine, but the Leon was just too sneaky for us. So we're going to have to rethink. We're probably going to go back to comp number one, to be honest. I don't You know what? I'm not even going to talk in the team group chat. I think I'm just going to go on the Daryl, and we'll see what happens. But I think we'll just go back to the old comp, because I don't see why not. It's not the greatest comp in the world, but... It counters them. I'm gonna switch to the slow. It counters them pretty well. And if they run tanks, we can win. If they run range, we can win. We can kind of do anything. So even though the Daryl is a little bit troll, you know, why not? Let's just run it. So let's hop into the first, or not the first game, I guess the third game. And uh, let's get into it. All right, so here we go into the next game. They're gonna keep the same comp, which don't know if it's gonna be good or bad versus our comp, but I guess we'll see. So I'm just gonna move up this right side over here to try and catch pain lacking i think we did and we're gonna be able to pick up a really early kill to start off this game so that's a really good start for us and i'm kind of just gonna chill in this bush wait till i get an opportunity to get a kill ah it's not a good opportunity to get a kill there's three of them there at least he's kind of toxic by pain they got the max speed so they're gonna be moving up here i'm gonna try and get behind them Gonna try and heal up fully. Oh no, Byron is super now. He's gonna use it on me, so again, I'm just gonna back up. Don't wanna force anything. They're all grouped up together, which is very toxic. Can't really push onto them very well. They have an invisible Leon. Oh, there he is. All right, we're gonna try and make a play here. Moving forward. Oh, the Byron got super again. Oh, there we go, no more super for the Byron. Gonna go for a roll here on Poyo. Gonna be able to get the kill. Not gonna be able to get another kill, though. Probably shouldn't have gone in when Zar died, but... We didn't lose any stars. I think we just tied in stars there. Trying to wait for Tuning to get super. Oh, that's not it. That was not the roll. Alright, we're gonna go down. So we're gonna need a team wipe here. I think Zar is waiting for me. Tuning's gonna be able to get a pretty cheeky kill over there. I think Zar should be close to super at this point. Tuni going for a sneak. Oh, he's going to get really good value over there. Tuni gets... Or not Tuni, sorry. Zar gets speed. We're going to roll in now. We're going to be able to get pain with the kill. And I think we're able to get the bell. We are. So we're going to charge our super up again. Tuni has his super. I'm close to mine. Tuni's going to use his. I'm going to get the speed. Tuni's going to go in for a kill. I'm going to go for a kill over here as well. And we're going to get the team wipe. And that is perfectly time don't need a vc two for two with the star player mega box daryl and that is going to be it so it's customary you know if you're if you're cool with the other team you know just say ggs at the end of a game and then leave so ggs to the other team they're the homies specifically Poyo, he's my goat but that is going to be it for today so if you guys enjoyed the live competitive match video let me know because this is actually pretty hard to do uh we did get good results we got lucky i think our team played really well but it's really hard to get these type of results when multitasking like this at the highest level of games. So I appreciate you guys watching. And if you guys liked it, let me know. Uh, but that's going to be it for me today. We face Tribe Gaming next. We're 6-0. I assume they're also going to be 6-0. So it's going to be a battle of the Titans to see who goes undefeated and gets first place in the season. So that's definitely going to be an epic video to watch. So make sure you guys check that one out. That's going to be it. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys again soon. Peace.